Hi, this is Justin from Ajar Productions. In this video, I want to give you a sneak peek at a new option you have when exporting responsive pages. It can be a challenge if you have a long responsive document with many pages and multiple layouts because it takes a long time to export. Well, what if you want to just test a page or a small range of pages, but you want them to be responsive? So somehow, for instance, in this document, I want to export the first three pages but I want the first three pages of all the layouts I have. Well, that new option is available in the full dialog, so I'm going to go up to N5 and choose Export HTML5 with N5. And now under Custom Range, you can see I've already typed it in. I can type in Responsive colon, and then any range I want. I could do 1 and 3, not include 2, or I can include the entire range from 1 to 3. And when I click OK, it'll export just 1 to 3, but it'll make it responsive. Let me show you in the output. Here I have page 1, page 2, and page 3. There are five pages in the InDesign document, right? So it's exported those three pages, and now when I go responsive, there's the other layout with three pages again. So that should be a helpful new option when you are testing your responsive layouts as you're building them. should save you a lot of time.